One day, the BMW guys, like 12 of them, designers, engineers, were just in my shop. And, and I invited them in, and I showed them my drawings. And next thing I knew, we were in Germany, Orlando and I, and, and this whole project started. And Orlando and I met uh, on a film shoot. I work as a gaffer as well for 20 years, and now it's a secondary thing. As I was kind of walking in, Willie approached me, because Willie's a gaffer, so he was like, he was there to work, and he said, how are you finding that bike? And I was like, you know, it's a bit twitchy. It's quite like, it's really like intense. And he said, uh, he said, yeah, well bring it if you want. I have one, and if you bring it to me, I'll, um, I'll do some work on it. So that's how we met. I invited him over to my garage and, and uh, just he's become a personal friend. I get to sort of just jump on a bike and I don't know, it's a great way. You, I'm more focused on a motorbike than I am really any other time except maybe when I'm working, but, but it's, it's, um, it's like a meditation. Uh, BMW used to be we used to be really good at, at the, uh, on the more functional level, rational level, but now we're also getting into really emotional bikes. I'd been talking to Orlando about building a new bike and he wanted a, you know, a custom bike. He loves BMWs. He has, I built him a, a 1964 R60. And it was like, okay, what's next? You know, what are we gonna do? How are we gonna really kind of, how are we gonna make this, you know, what are we gonna do that's gonna be super interesting? First time I met Orlando, it was, you know, you kind of wow, this is this big time movie star, you know. And then you you meet him, and you just get straight into the bikes, and you forget all that background. You just like just a couple of dudes hanging out talking motorcycles. But Orlando and Wooly, they uh, they really challenged themselves by building a four-cylinder custom, which is not easy. And I think the result is just stunning. They just took it in a completely different direction. They're really unexpected, but very, very cool. He's an artist, you know, I mean, he's really a craftsman. He has a vision and an understanding of motorbikes that, you know, is really second to none, so. We start that way, and from that point on, it's a collaboration. I really like to involve my clients. I'll take pictures and text them pictures and parts I'm building, and, and we talk about different things, and I, I really like them to be as, as in love with the bike as I am because you know, it's a lot of labor and love that go into these. 